He has the field for the opener. Jersey Sire Stakers taken down on the stretch by Beth Cumberland. One is slick gated. Owned by Arlene and Jules Siegel with Stefan Bouchard. The two is Avacal Future. Owned by Alphonse Lacava. Avacal spelled backwards with Renee Poulin. Three roses for Sammy. Owned by the Friend Racing Stable. Driving is Ron Pierce. The four is Deer Girl, owned by Rissy and O'Brien with Ross Wolfenden. Five, Stasi is Girl, Dave Miller for Salvatore Zenka. Six, Check and Raise, owned by the Manali Stable with Ross Krogan. And seven, Bancho, owned by Desk Realty Trust with Jeff Gregory. Exact to try, start the double. Post time in five minutes. Here they come. And fast off the car is Roses for Sammy. Stasia's girl as well. And Slick Gated will have a little bit of say, but not much, as Roses for Sammy has grabbed the initiative. On the outside, Stasia's girl is getting pushed forward. At the inside, Slick Gated has zipped up the pocket. It's five over Avacal Future. Another two lengths more to Dear Girl, shadowed by Check and Raise, and another four back to Bancha. On to the back stretch, and the two-year-old filly hooves the loudest. Underneath Stasia's girl, what a threat for Roses for Sammy to come out of the two-hole, and here she comes. Through a quarter, trading places, Roses for Sammy and Stasia's girl in 28 and one-fifth. Slick gated, falls back three lengths now. Check and raise, hasn't seen the pylons as yet. Avacal, future at the inside, and moving to the outside is Dear Girl, another four back to Bancha. Coming out on the freehold stretch the first time and under the heavenly tear drops up top. It's roses for Sammy and here comes Stasia's girl dragging Miller out of the hole. Miller couldn't hold her anymore and now is right after roses for Sammy. So these two are duking it out in the trenches in 58 and one fifth. Roses for Sammy. Stasia's girl is right after her again. Check and raise has now picked up the cover. On the inside it's slick gated. Third over dear girl. On the inside Avacal Future and on the outside Bancha. A well-grouped field of two-year-old pacing fillies go up the back stretch. Roses for Sammy and Stasia's girl have been at each other's throats since the beginning. The length and a half to check and raise. On the inside, it's slick gated. Then Dear Girl is in fifth. Three quarters in one, 28 and two. Soggy seconds. Around the turn, Roses for Sammy continues to hang on and grits her teeth and pulls away three. Taken over second by just saving ground is slick gated. Outside check and raise, but hung the whole mile. All done is Stasia's girl on the inside. Avacal Future. Meanwhile, Roses for Sammy's tired and is very vulnerable. On the inside, Slick Gate and on the outside, Check and Raise. Avacal Future coming late. Roses for Sammy barely makes it while bearing in at the end. Check and Raise look like for second. Avacal Future had to take up at the end in 159 flat. Possible interference with the two. Avacal Future just before the finish. Again, judges inquiry, possible interference three against the two just prior to the finish. Hold on to your tickets. Uh, your attention, please. We do have a disqualification for coming in in the stretch, going into the passing lane and impeding the progress of number two, Avacal Future. Number three, Roses for Sammy, has been disqualified from first and placed fourth. Once again, three interfering with the two in the deep stretch has caused Roses for Sammy to be DQ'd. The revised order of finish is now 6-4-2-3. 6-4 exact is $23.20. The try is $6-4-2, $59.20. Going to the second for $75,000 pressure all of a sudden on the screen, goes from left to right, right there, came over, forced over Avacal Future, almost putting a wheel underneath her, and thus the reason for disqualification. 